Hi friends, in this video we will learn how to configure site to site VPN using RSS signature with Microsoft Certificate Authority 2003. For that we require topology, we have topology R1, R2, they are connected to each other via ISP and we have a Microsoft Server 2003 as ACA and that's IP address is 192.168.105.100. In this topology, we would use ISP as a NTP server. Okay, so this is our topology and IP addressing. Let's start the configuration. We will start from R1, R1 lane. Then R1 lane. then default route toward the internet okay then we have to configure isp isp lane then isp lane then another interface then we have to configure r2 r2 lane then serial We have also defined default route toward the internet. Okay, let's check the reachability with the CA. Done with peer. Done. Then we have to check reachability from R1 to CA with peer. Okay, so when we are talking about certificate authority time must be synchronized and now we are going to configure isp as a ntp server before that we have to check what is the time okay 21 then we have to define clock set 21 10 20 14 feb 2016 then enter and configure here ntp master yes its configuration is complete then we have to go to r1 ntp server go to r2 also means both on r1 and r2 you have to define ntp server ntp server this one okay check time show Clock, yes, synchronize then crypto CA trust point triple T enrollment URL HTTP 192.168.105.100 cert serve MSF MSF dot DLL revocation check none crypto CA authenticate triple T yes crypto ca enroll triple t it will ask for password you have to go to ca on ca type the same url http ip address search serve msf msf.dll then copy this one and right click here enter right click enter no no yes do show okay now you can see here the certificate 
received from certificate authority do show history to check the commands now what we have to do we have to type same commands so best is this copy them and paste them to r2 okay then enter asking for password you have to go to the ca refresh the page you will obtain new otp copy that but be sure there should be no space copy right click enter right click enter no no yes yes you can see here the certificate received from certificate authority now we can use it for vpn how crypto iscan policy authentication encryption hash group lifetime then crypto ipsec transform set t set esp aes esp sha hmac mod tunnel crypto ipsec profile shiva set transform set t set exit interface tunnel zero then create i assign ip address 192.168.1.1 tunnel source will be serial tunnel destination will be peer ip yes what is the peer ip you can see in the topology peer ip is this one tunnel mod ipsec over ipv4 tunnel protection ipsec profile and profile name shiva and you can use ospf here router ospf 100 area 0 interface fast ethernet 0 by 0 area 0 here okay then you have to go to r2 same crypto high scan policy authentication encryption hash group lifetime then crypto ipsec transform set mod tunnel crypto ipsec profile shiva set transform set create interface tunnel assign the same subnet ip address here tunnel source will be its serial tunnel destination peer ip address tunnel mod ipsec over ipv4 tunnel protection ipsec profile shiva then ip ospf 100 area 0 interface f0 by 0 area 0 okay then if your configuration is correct now you can see the neighborship is up same thing on r2 you can find okay then show crypto icecamp sa yes active show crypto ipsec sa how many packets encrypted decrypted show ip ospf neighbor we are using ospf yes neighborship is established show ip route ospf now you can ping to r2 lane using r1 lane now you can see yes ping is working then show crypto ipsec sa you will find more packets with encrypted and decrypted count so this was our side to side vpn that how to configure side to side vpn between r1 and r2 using microsoft ca thank you